For some people, Major General Kasiria Gwanga was a hero. For other people though, he was the bane of their livelihoods. Last year, Gwanga became enthusiastic about the environment and climate change. In September, he destroyed what he claimed was the property of encroachers in Kabukira Central Forest Reserve in Kalangalo County in Mitiana District. I'm going to talk to Brigadier General Sabit, who is deploying armed people in forests. In the same month, Gwanga shot at the tires of trucks ferrying timber from Mitiana to Undeba, a hub of timber dealers in Kampala. Each and every forest that we go and cut, I provide the seedlings to replace the trees that have been cut. Each and every truck that he finds on the way from Mitiana, as he claims, he just opens, actually brings out his gun and shoots the tires. Timber traders, go plant your trees in your own land. Don't come on government land. They are lucky I shot the tires. Now I'm waiting, I'm going to burn them. So what is the impact of this uh, action of cutting trees and what in this area? The impact, you've just seen it. Why are you asking me silly questions? Earlier, in 2017, the military man had burned a tractor in Naziba village in Lubowa on Entebbe Road. The tractor had been clearing vegetation on disputed land. He shot three bullets into the sky. Everyone who was here ran for his or her life. They ran away from the site. Eventually, he carried a 10-litre jerry can of fuel, poured it on this tractor. What remains mysterious is that uh, the protagonists have not come out clearly. The claims that it's Brigade Akasiria Gwanga remain rumors. Controversy is not new to Gwanga right from 1985 when he switched from Dr. Andrew Kaira's Uganda Freedom Army and joined the National Resistance Army. Both armies were fighting to topple the Obote II regime. Some of the controversies include beating up Sevina Sechitoleko, a political aide to former Prime Minister Amama Mbabazi, shooting in the air to disperse a prayer crusade near Machindia Magistrates Court, stopping the police and army from carrying out an eviction at his home in Machindia despite a court order, and shooting at the car of Catherine Kusasira, a local musician. He was also accused of beating up shopkeepers who were flaunting the lockdown rules in Mitiana recently. At some point, he was reported as saying he would not salute the current army commander. For the two orders, Katu Yagana Kunda Giran Gendo College. Gana Front Line, Wagana Kumbu and Sagan's office. Gwanga spoke his mind and damned the consequences. This made him a darling of journalists who made sure that his quips always made news. Julian Nantume, NTV. I've got my small weapon. You come, you mess up, you are going to mess with it.